When the news broke this year that the Logies had been cancelled due to coronavirus, there was one TV star who greeted the news with a big cheer. Not Carl, no. <laughs> Comedian Tom Gleeson, who picked up last year's gold, now reckons that he's the Gold Logie carryover champ. And I caught up with Tom to find out about his plans for an extra 12 months of bragging rights. Welcome to the 61st Annual TV Week Logie Awards. Please welcome Mr Tom Gleeson. I feel like the Logies, if it was like a house party, the ABC, we're like the old neighbours complaining about the noise. Well, Tom Gleeson, welcome to the Today Show. I would say that it's a pleasure to interview you, but I, I feel like maybe I'll regret that by the end of our chat. Oh, uh, no, I'm lovely. I'm in a good mood. I'm stuck at home. I love my home. I'm in a tricky spot. <laughs> because I like it and I hate it at the same time. I bet you were happy the other day when they announced that the Logies were going to be cancelled because now you get to hold on to your gold Logie for another 12 months. Yeah, well, the, the controversy now, yeah, it's, it, it's not going to subside now because everyone's going to blame the, the epidemic on me that I only, maybe I started it just so I could hold the gold Logie for two years. But to be honest, I was very upset that the Logies were cancelled because I was ready to win back-to-back -back gold. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Welcome to Hard Chat. Now, does it annoy you that even though you don't party hard anymore, yeah. you still look like you do? <laughs> what have you been up to in isolation? I'm just out in the country. I, I've built a chook shed. I've been gardening. I've been building veggie patches. I, 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 it's, I've been like a lifestyle program, which kind of makes me feel a bit ill. You started out as a Marilyn Monroe impersonator. Yes. Now, she died when she was 36, and you're 37. I know, I'm glad about that, because someone said... Is that why said... your career died a year ago? <laughs> <laughs> We've all been doing a lot of, like, FaceTiming and Skyping and Zoom, Zoom chats. I feel like there's a new definition for hard chat, especially when it comes <laughs> to talking to older relatives. Yes, it can be very difficult. I've found that some of my family Zoom meetings have turned into a very, very low-grade form of show and tell. No one's talking anymore. They're just picking up cats and dogs and look at this, and then people are too close to the screen and there's bad lighting. It, it, from, from a TV production point of view, it, it's, a, it's a nightmare. I like my honey prawns to be snap frozen in 1988, thawed out in the 90s and cooked during the Howard era. That's why I like my honey prawns. <laughs> I know that you had to cancel a lot of gigs because of the coronavirus pandemic, but the very good news is, is that this is Amazon Prime special for your stand-up shows. Tell me a little bit about that. Yeah, well, you're right. The national tour I was doing got cancelled. Well, it's been postponed. We'll pick it up later. It's no big deal. But yeah, in the meantime, you can watch me on Amazon Prime. It's, it's, it's beautifully shot. And the best thing is, if you dim the lights, you can pretend you're at the gig. Because during my gig, there, were a lot of, there was lots of heckling and I just left it in. Like, a lot of comedians might edit that out. I left all the rough stuff in. <laughs> it's my lucky day. It's my lucky day that there are no hecklers. You haven't seen what I do to them. <laughs> this person, I'll get to you in a sec. Well, Tom Gleeson, thank you so much for joining us, and we'll see you next year at the Logies. All right. Thank you, Brooke.